Happy birthday? Ooh, okay. Literally, after Fish and Chill 2, there was, a, uh, there was an update with the camera and the jukebox. Now there's another update. Yo. <laughs> oh, man. That's a Look at all of them. Oh, that's beautiful. <laughs> Oh my goodness, that is amazing. Oh, they're using the Sonic CD. I don't know which track it's from. I keep forgetting all of them. Oh, uh, that's <laughs> so cool. All the Coco Away birthday ads. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. How do I hide this? I want to see this. Happy birthday, Sonic. Oh, that is so... <laughs> Oh, I love that so much. I mean, other than all the birthday decorations, all the cocoa wearing birthday hats. <laughs> okay, so I wanted to, I wanted to get the side story, but this is like a massive birthday thing. Too bad Sonic's got a headache on his birthday. He's hungover. Dang. So there's new cocoa hidden around the island. Why not? <laughs> get some side story on Sonic's birthday. Happy birthday! You get some side story. The reason we came here was because we detected the Chaos Emeralds were drawn here. Did you figure something out? I'm trying to put the pieces together. The Ancients' technology was built specifically for the Chaos Emeralds and runs on their power. All of the Starfall Island systems, even cyberspace, were in a kind of standby mode without the Emeralds to power them. Once the power supply was restored, though, someone would have had to boot up the systems and get them running. I think I can guess. Oh, Tails is wearing a birthday hat. I didn't realize that. Yeah, you know what? Why not? Uh, let's let's make it a little different. I'm gonna get the side story on. What? Oh my god! Okay, this even co. Okay, wow! I'm so happy. Every time I come and I do the side story stuff, there's always an update or something. Oh, that's amazing. Okay. Uh, let me. Is Sage wearing something different? Is she also wearing a birthday hat? Okay. Oh, okay. This is getting dope now. Oh, and there's the fishing spot as well. Okay, yeah. Now, I changed my mind. I changed my mind. Uh, I'm going to keep it on the birthday settings. I thought I was going to put it back to normal. I don't know what I'm doing, and I'm confused. Yo, Tails. Can you tell if there's anything special about the ruins with this symbol? I can't be sure without a proper analysis, but it doesn't seem remarkable. What is remarkable is the data retention after all these years. The corruption is negligible, and the maps are so accurate. Not to mention the way they can imprint the map data directly into the user's mind. It's hard enough explaining yourself to your peers, let alone some long-distance civilizations. Yeah, too bad they can't give us all the answers to the island's mysteries. You're right, though. Pretty amazing to have a civilization based on brain power. I didn't get any of that. <laughs> so, I, so I see now. So I guess each side story has mainly been based off of the Coco's technology in a sense. And what they've been able to develop while... Well, not the Coco, the ancient ones. I don't know. <laughs> I'm, I'm too distracted by the birthday decorations. Tails is wearing a birthday hat. The Coco wearing birthday hats. I'm not paying attention to anything. Sonic? Do you think I can change? What do you mean, like like a tire or the tornado's engine oil? No, I mean, when I was lost in cyberspace, I was confronted by another version of myself. He said I was just a follower, that I couldn't think or act on my own. I wanted to argue, but I couldn't bring myself to say anything back. I worry he's right and that I haven't changed at all. Whatever. Some spooky cyber copy hasn't seen you in action. I've seen it firsthand. You've definitely grown, and I know you'll keep on working hard. Mmm, okay, that's interesting. Normally, the side story consists of uh, 
the ancients and the island and the chaos emeralds but this one was a little more personal interesting i thought he was gonna mention sage about the whole you just weak and you follow sonic oh man stop the cap <laughs> if you haven't seen that go check it out oh my goodness it's, it's amazing oh, what i wouldn't give to study this ancient technology properly hmm. it doesn't look like this was a projectile weapon uh, so no ancient cannonballs then huh wait are you saying this is a beam weapon like on the egg carrier exactly from what i can tell it has its own battery independent of an outside power source Moreover, its capacity is ludicrous. It could level a mountain. It's almost up there with the Eclipse Cannon. But that was plugged into the Ark's reactor. This is freestanding. The Ancients' designs are amazing. Yeah, that's cool and all, but I mean, they built these things to shoot at something. Wow, what kind of enemy takes that much firepower to stop? And if this technology is reactivated into the world. Alrighty. Ah, uh, okay. So, Tails, where's your next your story at? This is not an ideal working condition. If I just had my body, I could be so much more efficient. Amy said she felt like she was in a dream. Does that sound about right? That's pretty accurate. So, that's another interesting thing I've been thinking about. Knuckles, Amy, and Tails, can they not interact with each other in cyberspace? Or are they all trapped in their own dimensions of cyberspace? Real to put their spirits into? It's one hypothesis. We certainly can't rule it out. Oh, wow, okay. That was quick. Beautiful place. <laughs> Where's your next one, bro? We're at a pretty high altitude. It's hard to say how high due to all the clouds. Any higher and we'd risk Angel Island bumping into us. Pretty harsh conditions for anyone to be living and working under. The ancients must have had a reason for coming up here. Given the infrastructure, I don't think this was a residential area. It seems more like military front lines. The first strike position, huh? I mean, those cannons aren't just for show. With everything we've seen, just what kind of enemy were they preparing for? They were the enemy. <laughs> the ancients didn't care, they just wanted world domination and they took down everybody. You know, they weren't really messing with people too much, so they just decided we're not having any of this and they just wanted to obliterate all the other races. Squid Games! Happy birthday, man. You're not gonna wish me happy birthday? Okay, I see how it is. I analyzed the cyberspace portal the last time you were accessing it. While you were online, it opened up a flood of data. It was way too much to process, but I did get a glimpse of the ancient's personal data. Oh, so... What, you know all their birthdays now? Much more than that. Sonic, it was their very essences. Their hopes, their dreams, everything that made them what they were. Do you see the correlation? Sounds a lot like what happened to you, Amy, and Knuckles. I mean, I'm glad you're all intact, but... Why were you all uploaded like that? Um, okay. Now it's time for Sage. But before I get to Sage, I want to see what these Coco are about. Because these Coco are, like, different. Okay. So, 112. So, this Coco is different. Wow, okay. So, these ones actually hold like six. Hmm. Hey, my samurai guy. Alrighty, okay. Hey, what are you, my man? So, we had a. Ooh, we got a sheriff with us. Damn. Okay, guys, you can come out now. <laughs> So I got the samurai and the sheriff. Hey, hey, yo, hey, 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 where the samurai, man? I, I, hey, oh my gosh, birthday cakes. <laughs> it's so amazing, man. I'm supposed to be focusing on the side story. I'm getting so sidetracked by the birthday. This is amazing, though. 135 skill points, and my batteries just died. But I still made it to my next guy, a magician. Nope. 
uh, not, not a Netherlin? You know those guys with the long hats? Amish, Amish. Yeah, the Amish guy. Dang, you doc. Oh, um, am I just seeing things? No. Oh, you're wearing a mask. Oh, okay. Mysterio, Mysterio Coco, Coco Pops. <laughs> Wow, you guys are special. You're getting put on all these high, dangerous platforms that I have no way of navigating. Okay, next Coco. Dang, just like that. What are you, man? I risk my life for you. A king! Oh, a queen. Looks like a king. <laughs> Bro, looks so wasted. <laughs> How many of your people are trapped on ledges? And is it worth me going to all of them before I see the purple cat? Ah, oh, she's not wearing any birthday decorations. Hey again, since we've grown so close, how about helping me out? I have run the simulations. Sharing data will not change the outcome. You're always talking about odds and simulations, but we living beings don't live by calculations. The will to live, the drive to achieve, the desire to protect the ones you love, that kind of thing can grant a power you can't imagine. Love can be converted into power. Do you have any data to back this proposed conversion? Um, the time you turn blue? That's what makes it miraculous. But if you really need proof, I'll whip you up a miracle by the end of all this. You'll see. Then again, I don't know when the side story takes place, because how can you prove this? You literally turn blue by watching Tails and Sonic reunite and accept each other for their flaws. You turn blue. You, I don't need no, I don't need to give you no evidence. We're coming up on the last Titan. Care to bet who'll be the winner this time? Recalculating. Your odds of victory have improved from impossible to highly improbable. Those are just the kind of odds I like to beat. So these were built by the ancients too, right? They're pretty powerful enemies. Did they manage to defeat the ancients enemies? I can only hope their next victim is you. Oh my god, Sage. <laughs> Please give me an answer. <laughs> She's changing again. She's going back to her old ways. <laughs> okay. So, so far the side story on Chaos Island isn't too intriguing. I think I stole like Amy's one because of how personal she made it. If I'm remembering correctly, considering it was months ago. So, as far as I can see, there's no other side story, so this is the last one. So, I think I've figured it out. The Coco are the spirits of the ancients, aren't they? What if they are? Huh. I've run into my fair share of spirits who stick around because of their regrets. Sometimes, I've been able to help them move on. Just how long have they endured like this, though? Were we brought here to help them finally find peace? Why ask me? Because, I feel like you might be in the same boat. And if so, I'll help if I can. Ooh, okay. Oh man, that's the side stories. Nothing too nuanced or groundbreaking discovery, but... Scanning the area, I don't see any other side story, nothing on any island. Dang, that's all the side story. So I guess I can try for one more Coco and then I want to go see how that cat's doing. I, I don't know if he's still crusty, if you know what I mean. Oh, goodness, what are you? Okay, okay, it was worth it because it was a king. Because uh, these challenges were getting harder. Yep, the king of Coco, I'll take that one. Oh, goodness, I actually, that was kind of hard. Um, but I'm like, as long as it's a, it's a significant Coco up here, and it is, it's a king, I'm happy. Okay, it's time to go fishing with Big. Ooh wee! Wow, he's big. Oh, they're the other ones! Okay. Hey, Sonic! Welcome back! Would you like to try? I'll let you borrow a rod. Um, dang, man. Uh, so... About last time, I might have gone overboard. Is that a frog on your thing? Um, anyways, you caught your own frog? That's dark, man. Um, <laughs> about last time, I'm still better than you. Uh, let's see. 
Let's see what atrocities we fish out of the toxic waste island today. Because <laughs> we got some really big fish in the last one. So I want to see... Ooh, but the... King Crab? Mr. Crabs? King Crab? Are you eating crab tonight? Damn! Because I caught some really big fish last time. So I want to see what I can catch here. Because it's been different for each pond so far. Ooh, I haven't seen any double rings yet, so that's not too bad. We caught the Megalodon! <laughs> oh, he's getting mad, man. He doesn't like what he's seen. <laughs> I thought it was over, but it's not. He's getting crusty again. Ah, oh, it's a chest, it's a chest, a chest. I was expecting an alligator or something, bro. Oh my goodness. I was expecting something big out of the pond. What? Okay. Salmon. The classic salmon. That's nice. I'm sure he's called that. Maybe not. I like how he's standing directly behind Sonic now. <laughs> like, more centralized. What's next on the menu? Come on. Yes, got him. Looks like an eel. Oh, of course, I get the small tadpole. It's not even being born yet, bro. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Still put it in the fire, though. Still good nutrition. Let me let me fish somewhere out, out, out there, like in the outer lake. Hey, it's a double one. <laughs> a snapping turtle. Oh man, no man, I have to catch an alligator now. If I'm catching snapping turtles like that with this arm strength, I've got to catch an alligator. Oh my gosh, biggest crusty. A snapping turtle? I'm eating turtles and a puffer fish? <laughs> Yo, these, <laughs> these fish are getting crazier and crazier. Oh my goodness, now I have to, I have to catch an alligator. Oh my goodness, I have to now. I am all now obligated to catch the gator. Hey, 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 whoa, 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 whoa. This is getting out of, this is getting out of hand now. I've got to catch an alligator soon, I'm sorry. Ooh, an or an or fish. Oh man, oh man, we're winning today. <laughs> What's next? A uh, Patrick. <laughs> He's the kind of starfish. We got Patrick Star. Damn, boy. <laughs> add, add him to the collection. Put him on the wall. Okay, <laughs> taxi derby, Patrick. Is SpongeBob next? This looks like a big one. Ooh! A black bass? That's a golden bass, not a black bass. What are you? Oh! oh, oh. <laughs> oh my gosh! You actually caught an alligator. I was just choking. I didn't see what it was, and then I saw it land on the floor. Like an oh my, I caught an alligator. Oh my goodness! <laughs> this is getting crazy. Oh, that's why I'm, I'm happy. I'm satisfied. I don't know what other fish I can get, but an alligator will take it. Yeah, man. Now, big is triggered beyond belief. And then, of course, we get an even bigger fish. Oh, man. Oh, no, man. <laughs> we caught an alligator. I was just joking. <laughs> alligator, bro. I can't get over that. Oh! I have a shark! Nah, stop! Nah, I came here to apologize. I'm getting hammer sharks. Nah, this is too much now, actually. This is getting out of hand. A hammer shark and an alligator. An octopus. Oh my goodness. Nah, he's triggered. I think this is his life. I think he's had enough. <laughs> he's had enough. You've got to be kidding me, a freaking hammer shark. Oh, for, 
Og Bly har brugt dog samme chok. <laughs> this is amazing. This is my this is by far the best fishing experience I've had throughout this entire game. Oh my gosh, back to back a uh, uh, hammer shark and I'm getting his cousin or the whole cousin the blue hammer shark. Now we're getting Patrick's black cousin, the black starfish. Okay, this one is in a massive ring. A stingray! I think we should, uh, again, like I said with the whole dog frog, I don't think we should be holding these things, man. A stingray, what's next, man? A hammer shark, a stingray, the megal... The purple megal... The purple megalodon, the sister. <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Now we get a black megalodon? We had a white one, then a colorful. Now we're getting the black brother. Oh my gosh, man! Yo, I think big. I, I think that's it for big. I think I think he's gonna retire after this one. Yeah, no, okay, that's it. I'm done, bro. I I. <laughs> I'm done, man. I'm I'm happy. I'm happy. Oh my gosh! Now, but it's time, bro. I think you need to retire. Your time is up. Big. Bro, I'm sorry, man. No, I own the rod. It's mine now. So, all in all, that is crazy. Uh, caught every species of fish. Um, Big needs to retire. Look how triggered he is. He's he's really mad now. He didn't expect me to improve so quickly. Wow, that was that was amazing. Uh, we need to catch an alligator. Catches an alligator. Catches a hammer shark, and then proceeds to catch a second hammer shark. That was the best fishing experience ever. That was awesome. I didn't expect to catch so many fish because I'm like, oh, I've done this before. It's going to get boring. And it didn't. Oh, that's amazing. Oh, man. I'm sorry, man. You got to retire. You really suck, bro. You really got to up your fishing game. You saw what I caught today, man. I caught an alligator. Two of them, bro. What did you catch? Nothing. I don't know what you got on your rod over there, but you better retire, man. And of course, on my final fish before I want to max out my tokens, I get a hammer shark. Perfect. That the odds of that happening were one to zero. Because I wanted to see if I could max it out at nine nine nine, and hopefully get. get I got the hammer. I'm done. I, I'm sorry, bro. You are like I said, man. You gotta retire. Yeah, I don't need your rod. I am the rod. Okay, let's see. Uh, what am I gonna buy this time? Wow, there's nothing else I can buy other than. Dang, um, use everything to increase my speed. Okay, so we did get to 83. Ooh, oh, that's amazing. Okay, okay. Sonic's birthday, 20 levels of speed, 20 species of fish. Wow, other than Sonic's headache. That was awesome. I enjoyed that. We destroyed Big, we blew him out of the water this time. Side story was alright. <laughs> the fishing was fantastic. Sonic is officially 17 levels away until I f 16 levels away until I fully max him out. Uh, it's time for the Titan. In the next episode, because I love cliffhangers, it's been your boy. Thank you for watching. <laughs> I can't believe I caught an alligator. I'll see you, alligator, and the next one. See you later, alligator. <laughs> fish after fish after fish after fish and I'm still better than you bro what did you catch today nothing what did you catch today tell me I'm still better than you